killed. Is something wrong? Sounds like someone's in trouble. It's Jax. You heard some rumor about Tanakh the loitering around where they're not supposed to be. Took off south for Stone's Echo the next day to find them. Damn fool. Who is this Jax, exactly? My friend. Ain't it obvious? Bit younger than me, can still move without every bone creaking. <laughs> Knows his way around a bow, too. Good company to share a drink with. When there's sweet sap to drink anyway. But I told him, stick your hand in bramble and you're bound to catch a fist of thorns. Maybe I should find this guy. Stone's Echo, he said? That's right. Uh, if you don't mind me, these roots aren't gonna dig themselves. Fair moment, please. It's lucky for me that you're here, Outlander. The name's Jax. A squad of Tanakh is holed up in that cave. I think they're in trouble. At least one of them is injured. I'm here to offer help, but with the Tanakh, such an offer might be perceived as an insult, even when help is needed. Will you stand with me? I saw you speak before the chorus, so I know you can be persuasive. And if things get out of hand, I will be stronger with your spear at my side. I'll do what I can. You there! This camp belongs to Eagle Squad. Retreat or die. At ease, Eagle. I'm not here for blood. Just to parlay. You know the parlay sign? Let us in so we can talk. So far, so good. Long way from the desert, aren't we? This one was blinded. Boy, nothing gets by you. Looks like your training mission didn't go according to plan. We're here to help, if you want it. How does an Utaro know we're on a training mission? He knew how to request a parlay, too. He's not Utaru. Or Tenax. He must be a veteran. A veteran? I didn't think there were any left. We don't need help from a washed-out farmer. Could have fooled me, judging by the look of things. Sister, it sounds like they just want to help us. Why not let them? What have we got to lose? You said you're on a training mission? A machine hunt. The final test before a young squad goes on active duty. Everything was going fine. We tracked a cloth strider and hit it hard, but it fled into a herd of bristlebacks. One charge right at Kore. He dodged just in time and landed a strike as it passed. I hit an acid canister. The spray was like fire in my eyes. A terrible wound. I should have scouted ahead, spotted the herd. No, I should have spotted that canister. What does it mean to be a veteran? I was born to knock, but offered to Utaro in exchange for tribute. Tribute? Back when there was plenty, the Utaru offered yearly gifts of food to the Tanakh to keep peace between them. Over time, this tribute grew into an exchange of people. The Tanakh needed able-bodied youth to fight their clan battles. And the Utaru needed veteran soldiers to train the defenders of Plainsong. I was just such a soldier. Was being the key word. You may yet need my spear, young warrior.
What do you need? Supplies. Dried meat, ammunition, weapons, camping equipment. A lot of provisions for a trip back to the desert. Everything we need is at Riverwatch. A huge cache of war spoils up there, left over from the route. The route? When our forces drove the Karja back to Baron Light, they made sure the Kestrels felt the loss, made it hurt. Marshal Canera shot a score of fleeing Karja from the top of Riverwatch, and her squad gathered the loot. It's all just sitting up there. Ours for the taking. Deadly machines are known to patrol that place, and the ruin itself is on the brink of collapse. You think machines and rotting ruins are enough to keep out Eagle Squad? No, but your injuries are. Let Jax and I grab these supplies for you. This is our mission. I'm not handing it over to some... Fine. Come with us. Fine. The three of you hold position. I'll be back. Be safe, sister. The ruin is this way. Once we get those supplies, everything will be fine. So you say. What's that supposed to mean? Your brother's condition is... That's not your problem, farmer. So you say. Stop saying that! Hey, calm down. We're trying to help, remember? So you say. We'll have to cut across the river. Oh. Avoid the outlander camp down the road. Something wrong? I hate getting wet. Tough as a ravager, this one. We're here. The entrance should be right under that arch. Frost isn't gonna do much. Blocked. Not getting in that way. Let's check around the side. I could grab the supplies for Sakura while I'm poking around in here. The last of them. I had that. Going gently. Maybe I would have handled it better if I wasn't busy covering you, old man. Aren't I lucky? I guess the farmer hasn't lost all his fighting spirit. Supplies should be up there. Taller than I thought. What's a deadly climb to Eagle Squad? What are you trying to say, old man? Enough. I've climbed this tower before. I'll grab the supplies. Come. Let's see if any of these machines have parts we can strip. Maybe I'll show you a thing or two. What could a farmer possibly know about salvage? Only decades of experience compared to your very brief existence. Okay. Gotta find a way into the ruins.
here before. Must have missed the supplies. No cash. There must be higher up. These are the supplies. Won't last them very long. I can't leave that kid alone for a second. Jax and Sakura are in trouble. I gotta. Get in there and take down those machines. Done. I better check on Jax and Sakura. Well fought, Eagle. Though I would have preferred if you hadn't taunted that thing. What did you find? Uh, practically nothing. Sakura, there's maybe a day's worth of food here and some rotting medicinal herbs. It was supposed to be more. Enough for. It was never your intention to go home, was it? What do you mean? A blind Tanakh can't fight. And if you can't fight... The Tanakh will kill Korra from being blind? He'll face a trial against the machine. They say it's more dignified that way. But it's still a death sentence. So you were gonna use the extra supplies to live in the wilds? I thought it would be enough to get us started. Can't they stay in Plainsong? Plainsong has too many mouths to feed. The chorus would never allow it. We should get back. I'll take this young sprout back. Meet us at the cave when you can. Speak the truth, plain and simple. Aloy, we were just about to head in. So what will you tell them? That we'll have to make do. Survive in the wilds without the supplies. That will be a hard life. Better than letting Cory be killed if we go back. There must be another way. 
I don't see one. So, we're all stocked up then? The cash was empty. But we'll be alright without them. I can't let you starve out here. Just leave me. No! Jax, you said Plain Song has too many mouths to feed to take them all in, but what about just- I am not leaving my brother behind! He'll be safe in Plain Song. And the rest of you can head home. It's the only real solution you've got. The Chorus won't like it. But if I vouch for the boy, share my rations with him, I could convince them. I will do so if Korra wishes. No! You're not taking him! Sakura. I think... this is the best option. I'm a burden to you out here. This is what I want. Let me go with him. Permission granted. But brother, this is not the end for us. I will visit you in Plainsong, and no Utaru or Tanakh can stop me. They will be foolish to try. I'll stay and help them pack their gear, then take Korra back with me. You've shown strength and wisdom today. A rare combination. You have my thanks, and theirs too, I'm sure.